Tony Ryan Sawyer, and today we'll be going to be going doing a presentation. It's called the Juvenile Justice System and Libertarianism. What is the libertarian position on juvenile justice and minors and the law? Is the current system compatible with libertarianism, or does it violate the non-aggression principle? My position is that the current juvenile justice system and the way that we treat minors is incompatible with libertarianism and violates the non-aggression principle. Status offenses and libertarianism. The first thing we'll be talk we'll talk about that is incompatible with libertarianism and the non-aggression principle is status offenses. The most notable example of a status offense is compulsory education which I believe is a form of child slavery and violates the 13th Amendment of the United States Constitution. Compulsory education ultimately leads to children rightfully rebelling against such injustice, but then the system jails them and they can't get a job. Thus, they turn to a life of crime in order to survive. Thus, compulsory education leads to more crime. It is also racist because blacks, with their history of slavery, black children rebel against the system more than white children. Also, I also believe that black children are unfairly targeted more than white, for we know from statistics that this is true of drug laws. Also, compulsory education was promoted by Karl Marx, and is a plank of the Communist Manifesto. And we know from history that communism is fundamentally evil, with communists like Joseph Stalin killing more people than Hitler. And those that were lucky enough to survive were poverty-stricken and lived under a communist tyranny. So it goes without say that communism and libertarianism and the non-aggression principle are incompatible. I firmly believe that all status offenses are incompatible with libertarianism and the non-aggression principle because all status offenses are victimless crimes and the implementation of victimless crimes is a transgression of the non-aggression principle and is thus incompatible with libertarianism. Also, status offenses is a form of age-based discrimination against the youth. And libertarianism teaches that all should be equal and should be treated equally by the law and the government. Therefore, I believe that all people, regardless of age, should have the same rights as adults. Because not giving people the same rights is a form of discrimination and is incompatible with libertarianism. Trying minors as adults and libertarianism. The second thing will be looking at that is incompatible with libertarianism is the fact that minors are tried as adults yet don't have adult rights such as the right to vote. This is a form of age this is a form of discrimination and is incompatible with libertarianism. This concludes my PowerPoint presentation on juvenile justice and libertarianism. I hope you enjoyed. This is Tony Ryan Sawyer signing out.